Hello friends and fellow hype beasts. Happy Monday. I hope you're all having a wonderful day and I hope you're ready for some unboxing because we have a lot of boxes that need to be unboxed today. We've spent a lot of money on the Essen sale this year. Our total cost before before all discounts were taken off and everything for everything in these boxes, this pair of shoes, this backpack and everything in it was over $4,500. But I don't want to give you the, the final sales price just yet. You have to stick around for that. But yeah, if we paid full price for everything, over $4,500, which is insane. But you know, we save up all year for this exact purpose. But let's get right into it because we have a lot to go through. And we're going to start with the Balenciagas. You know, the Balenci's shoe size on my toe. They know me everywhere I go. Hopefully that doesn't get copyrighted, but that was a terrible rendition of that song anyway, so it shouldn't. We're good. But yeah, we got the Balenciaga Track Runners. This has been a pair of shoes that I've wanted for a very long time. And we picked them up at the Essence VIP sale, which is the sale that happens before the regular sale, you know, and it's 30% off everything that's listed there. I still have no idea how you get invited to the Essence VIP sale. Somehow I did. Um, if you did too, I Maybe you know, and you can let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, that's where we picked these up. This is our first purchase. These are regular $920, I think, on Essence. For I don't know why they're $100 cheaper or $200 cheaper than on Balenciaga, but I'm not complaining. But yeah, we got them for 30% off, so we ended up paying $644 for these, which, you know, is a pretty good price for for a $1,200 pair of shoes almost. And after we picked those up, we got into, you know, the actual clothing items because the, uh, oh, excuse me, the full blown Essence sale started shortly after that. And our first order was, was pretty intense. I'm not gonna lie. We got this off-white belt in the yellow, which surprisingly, I don't know if you can see the belts I have behind me, but I have pretty much every other color you can buy except for the OG yellow, so we had to pick that up, and we did, and we got this for a pretty good price. Regular, they're about $290. Um, we picked this one up for about $170, so some good savings there. We picked up this backpack from Axel Origato. Um, I put some off-white tags on it because, you know, you got to add some customization, and I'm kind of an off-white fanboy, but we're not going to talk about that, but yeah. Axel Origato backpack. It's a huge backpack because you know, university, you need a lot of books to get that, the, get those good grades going, you know? So, we got a big backpack. <laughs> like, literally the biggest one I could find, and it's perfect. This backpack was originally about $216, and we picked it up for $180. It came with a pair of chopsticks, which is kind of cool. Hoodies are kind of my love, and after buying the Balenciaga track runners, we needed to buy a hoodie. So we bought the Balenciaga campaign hoodie. It's a nice, nice hoodie, you know, from 2017 actually. So a little bit of a OG piece. And this one was pretty good savings. It was on for $850. We picked it up for $650. I mean, $200 off isn't that much, but any discount on stuff like that is good discount. I think right now it's on for like $550, but there's probably only a couple of sizes left. We did good in the, in the first week of the Essence sale because that was, that was ordered literally the day the Essence sale started. The next order we made after that one was actually an order for a video I made which you can watch up in this little corner if you would like to. It was for the Essence gift guide for under a hundred dollars and I don't have all of the items anymore because you know they were gifts so I gave them away as gifts. First off, we have these Saturday's New York City socks. I mean, it's a pretty plain pair of socks, but if you watched that video or if, you, or if you've heard me talk about Saturday's New York, then you'll know they're, they're, they make some good stuff and those socks are, are no exception to that rule. Those socks are so comfy and I've worn them honestly almost every day since I got them, which is kind of embarrassing to admit, but that's okay. Then we got this Levi's t-shirt, you know, I decided to keep it for myself because I'm kind of selfish like that. And this one we picked up for $20. I think it was regular like $40. And then we got this Nike bag, which unfortunately went off sale like, the day after I bought it. But we picked this up for $17. It's regular $25, I think. It's just 
basic bag and that was kind of what we were going for in that video is just some basic hype beast essentials so that was all good we obviously saved some money there gave some presents away and yeah it was all good it was all good all right now is where the savings really start to kick in because almost every item in these in these box is why did i say that so weird <laughs> anyways almost every item in these boxes were all pretty much 70% off. That's right, 70% off. We have Off-White, we have, you know, 1017 Alix Studios or Alex or Ali X, however you pronounce it. I don't even know how to say it, but yeah, we have that, those, this. We have a random identity shirt, but you know what? Let's let's stop talking and let's get into it. And hopefully the crinkly crinkle paper is not too crinkly. Do it very quietly. Who, who are we kidding? Who are we kidding? I'll just talk loud over that. Okay, first thing we have is Op White T-shirt. This bad boy retailed for $450. That's right, a $450 T-shirt. One of the most expensive T-shirts I ever own. But we got this for $135. That's over $300 in savings. Like. What? Excuse me? $300 off off white shirt? How many times do you say off in that? But yeah. So this one's pretty basic on the front. It just has like the little off white fall winter 2020, which is nice. Obviously a main label. And then on the back, this is the unfinished oversized shirt. And that's pretty dope, honestly. Like for $135, an off white shirt like this, like, come on. It doesn't get better. Like it really doesn't. So that was the first piece of off-white we picked up. If you haven't ordered on Essence or haven't been a part of the Essence sale and you're just watching this, even though the Essence sale is about to end, I'm assuming so at least it usually starts dying down after everything goes on to 70% off. That's kind of when the Essence sale rounds up and that's the time when it's like, if there's something you want, like everything's gonna be on final sale pretty much if it's above that 65 to 70% mark, it's gonna be on final sale, but stuff goes fast during that time so if there's something that you're on the fence about but you think you might want it you should pick it up because sizes are gonna like be gone like, like i ordered that t-shirt the day after the 70 percent started and i think there's only like a size double xl left now so you gotta do it fast so this is the most expensive pair of pants i have ever purchased the retail price for this pair of pants is one thousand and eighty dollars that's right, a pair of pants worth over a thousand dollars. We have a pair of off-white cargo pants here. And I have wanted a pair of off-white cargo pants since I got into hype beasting for so about three years now. And it was finally time. We paid $350 for these pair of pants, which I know still is a lot of money for a pair of pants, but considering that they were a thousand and eighty dollar retail price. Like that's pretty good. And these pants are insane. They have like, the details on them is just crazy. There's these zippers at the bottom with huge off-white labels. Like, what do you even call these zippers with rings or hoops, you know? The bigger the hoop, the bigger the, I'm not gonna finish that statement, but you know, these are pretty small hoops. But yeah, there's some crazy detail on them. We have like the off-white stripes in there. The right leg, I think it is, has off on it, which is pretty cool, and I got them, they have these, I think there's still some sizes available actually, they have these in the blue, orange, and black, I opted for blue because I have a lot of black cargo pants, orange is really hard to wear I feel like, so we went for, for blue, it kind of looks like a denim material, and they honestly just look so cool, there's going to be some sick outfits getting put together shortly with these, so stay tuned to the Instagram, you know, we'll put it somewhere around here to see those pictures, but yeah. These are the pants. They're very nice pants. I like pantalons, pantaloons. But yeah, cargo pants are kind of like my, my thing right now. So, you know, we need to pick up some off white cargo pants. And we did. I literally thought that we were done, but we still have the final box. And this one hasn't even been opened. So, oh no. Oh, here it is. Our handy dandy anti-social social club pocket knife, scalpel.
perfect. So this is our final order of the Essence sale. It's sad, but you know, we had to we had to save money because there's some big things coming to the channel. So subscribe if you want to see those because there's going to be some cool stuff coming real soon and, and going forward even to, into the summer months. We have a lot of fun things planned. Yeah, I plan far ahead because OCD life, you know. But anyways, let's get into this. This crinkle paper is so loud. Ooh. These are sick, actually. So, if you've been around, you, you'll know that I'm really into socks, and like, there's nothing better than a good pair of socks, especially when they're designer socks. So these are from Alix Studios, or Alec, I don't even know how to say it, I should know, but I don't know, because I'm a bad hype beast, but, <laughs> excuse me. Yeah, we have some socks from 1017 Alix Studios, or whatever you want to call it, in red, blue, and white, USA, baby! Even though we live in Canada, so we'll just we'll just not we'll just get rid of the blue ones. Red and white, Canada, eh? That's what I'm talking about. We'll do have a full review coming on these socks shortly. I'm just kidding. I probably won't do a full review, but we'll probably talk about them again in a different video. But yeah, so these. Sorry, I forgot to talk about pricing. These were regular $120 for for the three pack, and we paid them for three pack. <laughs> Wow, caffeine is great. But yeah, we paid about $43 for these. I don't know why I keep saying about. It was exactly $43 plus shipping and GST and all that. This is our last t-shirt. This is from Random Identities. It cost $85 retail. We paid $32. I don't know what the exact percentage saved is, but white t-shirts are where it's at. Like if you know me, you know that. There's literally a clothes rack of white t-shirts in my room because I love them so much. And, oh, the neck. There's nothing like a good neck on a t-shirt. That's the best part of a t-shirt. But yeah, this is Random Identities t-shirt. I've never ordered from Random Identities before or I've never owned anything of Random Identities, but it feels pretty good. Designed in Berlin, made in Portugal. And then there's a little taggy on the back. It like looks a little short. Like, it looks oversized, but it looks short. Maybe it's fine, I don't know. But yeah, good savings on that too. And another white t-shirt to add to the rotation. And this is sad. This is really sad. Because this is the last item of Essence Sale 2019, even though it's 2020 now. This means that... I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. This means that Essence Sale is coming to an end. And the Essence videos are coming to an end. But only, only for this season. There are the spring sale, spring summer sale or whatever, so we'll have some videos coming out then on it. But for now, this is the last item of Essence 2019. The last Essence item of the decade. That's crazy. This is the off-white belt in this silverish colorway, and it's like real shiny and silvery, and like I love that. This belt, much like the yellow belt, retail for $290. Ooh, it has like this rubber on it here. Damn, the details on this are beautiful. It's so shiny, oh my god. But we paid $125 for this belt. Regular $290, like you can't go wrong. You really can't. I know the Essence sale is about to come to an end, but for future Essence sales, or even if you want to pick some stuff up before it ends, you can't go wrong. Like I've said in every Essence Sale video in the past, everything that they sell is 100% legit. Like, I've never had an issue with anything that they've sent me. It's all 100% authentic. Like, you can tr just trust me. Like I said, in today's video, we unboxed over $4,500 worth of items. You can take it from me that everything that they do is legit and authentic. And if it wasn't, I wouldn't support them. So now it's time to talk about how much money we saved. Because like I said many times in this video, the total retail cost of everything that we unboxed today was over $4,500. The actual total was $4,582.28. And we saved 45.3%. So the total that we spent was $2,506. Which is still a lot of money, don't get me wrong, but that's a lot of savings. And, you know, I'm, I'm happy with everything we picked up and I'm happy how everything's gone over this 
SN Sales season. I'm sad that it's all over, but you know, all good things must come to an end at some point, right? But yeah, that's going to be it for me for today and for, for Essence 2019 and, you know, 2020. Baby, we got the 2020 vision now. You know how it is. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. Once again, thank you for all of the support that you've been showing recently. I really appreciate it and it motivates me to, to make even better quality videos going forward. So if you did enjoy today's video, make sure to like and subscribe because I, I really appreciate it. You know, from the bottom of my heart, I do really appreciate it. But that's it. No more Essence Sale videos, video, videos, videos for a while. So if you hate the Essence Sale, this is good, good news for you because you don't have to see them anymore. But I'm a head out, all right? So we'll catch you next week. Peace. Hey, no, no, no.